Well, folks, this is a situation you never want to be in because I didn't see this. I didn't actually anticipate seeing all this water. Uh, but yeah, I'm stuck in water, as you can see. Everyone's driving around it. My engine stalled as I got in the water, so I don't know if it's over the exhaust pipe because if I get out, I get in water here, as you can see. Uh, brother, and I was supposed to go to the eye doctor too. What the fuck, man? Well, the water seems to be going down now. A guy behind me said that uh, the water probably went in my air intake, which is... I don't know how bad that is, but it's not good. I'll tell you that. This puddle of water snuck up on me big time, although it's starting to wane down now, as you can see. More of the road again. I haven't tried to start the car for obvious reasons, so... Yeah, there you have it. I think a trooper's going to get here... Um, I don't have my AAA information in the glove box like it was supposed to be. So, ah, brother. It's just, this is just a mess. A complete fucking mess. Not fun at all. Anyhow, that's just an update on what's going on. What's what's going to happen is I'm going to get AAA to flatbed it out of here. So, <sighs> I swear to God, man. I'm having nothing but bad luck with cars this year. I just got this thing. I mean, really, I just got it. Yeah, that's been happening every couple of seconds as people pass. Anyhow, there you go. Well, this isn't good. Look at this. Nothing. Nothing at all. Wait. Look at that. Turn it on and it just clicks and derps. When you leave the door light on, sometimes it just flashes for no apparent reason. That's not starting, that's just turning the battery on. So this thing clearly is just... I think maybe the battery shorted it, or maybe the computer's busted or something. If water got in the intake, I really hope that didn't kill the engine. I don't know if that kills engines or not, but I guess we'll find out here in a second. Whatever. Okay, so the AAA guy flatbedded the car over to uh, the place where I get my sob serviced. Uh, I got the old one serviced there, too. Uh, so here's what it looks like. I think the battery pretty, probably got shorted out because uh, you saw the electronics were acting real funny in the last segment of this video. And eventually they just stopped working entirely when I when it was uh, drop when it was uh, towed over they um, the I couldn't it, it didn't lock I couldn't lock it I had to get in there and manually push down all the little lock things and um, so you know that was that uh, so I'm pretty sure the battery is just done uh, as far as uh, water getting in the intake uh, the, the guy who uh, towed the car told me that it's not gonna, it's probably not going to kill the engine. It just needs to dry out and be cleaned and whatever. But um, so that's good. I just hope the engine isn't bad. I d so what I'm worried about now is the battery and the computer and you know the wiring and whatnot. Uh, so there you have it, folks. Uh, that Saab's a tough car. I think she'll pull through. But, uh, if not, oh well. So, unfortunate events, man. I'm having a bad, I'm just having a bad year for cars. God, I learned how to, I learned how to get rear-ended, and I also learned how to not drive into water. <laughs> so, not fun, not fun at all, guys. Learn from my mistakes. Uh, basically what happened is, uh, this is all, this rain is like fallout from Hurricane Isaac, and, um, there was so much rain that I couldn't see the puddle. I couldn't, I, I felt it, so I slowed down, and then I ended up going straight into the water, so I couldn't really see the fact that the puddle was that deep, or even see that I was going into a puddle just because the rain was that bad. And I was on my way to the eye doctor, ironically enough, <laughs> so... You know, what, the the best word for all this is a clusterfuck. It was just one 
big clusterfuck, and I, I, I'm just so done with car mishaps, it's not even funny. I hope after this nothing else happens, because uh, frankly, I'm just tired of it. <laughs> I'm tired of all of it. But I just thought I'd update you guys on what was going on, and um, if the car doesn't pull through, I'll make a video. If the car does pull through, then, you know, this is the end of it. So, there you have it. Uh, have a good one, everybody. Ciao.